Caitlin Stark brings the captive Tyrion Lannister to the Aerie. Caitlin has arrested him on suspicion of involvement in the attempted assassination of her son Bran and expects Lisa's support given her earlier accusation. She is shocked to see that Lisa still breastfeeds Robin, despite him being so old. Robin is prone to fits of histrionics, demanding to see the bad man fly. Lisa calls him a strong and mighty ruler, worthy of the Vale's leadership, but Caitlin appears skeptical. Tyrion agrees to confess to his crimes and is brought before the high seat. He presents a list of minor misdemeanors from childhood, though Robin is particularly intrigued by some of them. Tyrion demands a trial by combat to prove his innocence and calls upon his brother Jaime Lannister to be his champion, even though getting word to Jaime and his arrival would take many days. When his request is refused, the mercenary Bronn agrees to be his champion, much to Tyrion's surprise and relief. Bronn triumphs against Lysa's champion, Esser Vardis Egan, and he and Tyrion are allowed to go free. Robin is disappointed at being deprived of an execution by Moondor. Caitlin visits Robin and Lisa before leaving the Vale to join her son Rob's army. She asks Lisa to commit the Vale to the war on the side of the Starks and Tullys, but Lisa refuses, saying the Vale's knights are needed at home to defend Robin.